But like, look at me, look at the bank. It's these moments the oh, yeah. helping twin sisters through their heartbreak. The kids love being in the ocean. Alexis Rizard. I always take trips with them. I always see the ocean. Wants to remember everything. These photos mean a lot more. Yeah, yeah video. Than what they did two or three or four weeks ago. It makes me feel like he's still here. But he's not. Malik Douglas died at age 17. Tuesday around 11.40 p.m., he was driven to St. Francis Hospital in Federal Way. Then police were alerted that the teen had been in a car with friends in Tacoma. A gun allegedly had been passed around, and one of the people in the car shot and killed Alexis's oldest son. I want my baby back. I want my baby back. I want to hold him again. This situation not only changed our life, but it changed a whole other family's life and the, the life of the community. Alicia Streeter is by her sister's side to spread a message. Put the guns down. You're not cool. It's either you're going to take someone's life or you're going to give your life away. I value my life. You know, it's not cool to hold a gun. It's the word she plans to keep saying as she remembers her son. The hashtag Malik will live is because his Organs are helping people save lives, and I want my baby's legacy to live on. Malik's dad wants that too. Here they celebrate the best moments of his life. Lived it, and he had fun doing it. Yeah. And remember him as someone who loved his family. <laughs> you loved him? Now the pictures that mean so much are a reminder of a life gone too soon. In Federal Way, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News. And that shooting happened along Marine View Drive in Tacoma. The 17-year-old was arrested in connection with Malik's death.